because we're going to have uh, more deduction up front is typically better than deducting later. So if we can get the deduction earlier, typically that's what we would want to do. All right, election. You elect to take the section 179 deduction by completing part one of form 4562. Caution, if you elect the deduction for a listed property described in chapter five, complete part five of form 4562 before completing part one. One of the major components of listed properties are things like the car, for example, as we have seen multiple times, will often have special rules related to it because listed property is the kind of property the IRS is a bit skeptical of because if I was an IRS auditor, I would be imagining, for example, some rich business person in a $300,000 car cruising the strand and then basically writing it off as a business expense and probably thinking to myself, do you, I mean, I feel like a car is there to drive from point A to point B from the office to the client's place of work. So it seems like an excessive write-off of a $300,000 car. But again, you can argue that you need a $300,000 car because that's what's pulling in the clients, man. That's what's bringing, that's the money maker right there. I don't know. But, the, but you could see why the listed property then gets treated separately, possibly more restrictions on the ability to depreciate in an accelerated fashion.